welcome to java forum now i am going to show you how to install oe schema that is order entry schema in oracle database 19c enterprise edition so here you can see this is oracle home okay oracle database 19c home and uh, so under that demo directory uh, schema you can see that i have extracted the uh, db sample schema was 19.2 uh, okay so under uh, oracle home demo schema i have extracted the sample schema so among that we are going to see how to install order entry schema okay so order entry schema contains uh, data files, SQL files, XML files. Okay. So among that OE underscore main dot SQL is the main entry point. So that is the starting point of uh, schema installation file. So here you can see that I have replaced the sub underscore CW string with the absolute path. And one more important thing, I have deleted the object IDs. Okay. So I have deleted the object IDs in the all the SQL script. So uh, deleting the update ID is optional. If you did not face any issues, means it's not a problem. So I have faced some issues related to creating types. Okay. So I have deleted the object IDs. Okay. Now let me open the SQL plus. Okay, so I am logging to container database, this is TV, that is main database I am logging to check whether pluggable database or up or not. Okay, so ORCL PDB is showing just mounted. Okay, so what I am doing, I am changing the ORCL TV, ORCL PDB pluggable data to read write mode. Then only you can install the schemas. So make sure that your pluggable database is up and running and it's in read write mode. Okay. Then only you can install the schemas. Okay. So in TNS name that or I have made the entry for or cell PDB pluggable data database so that I can able to log in directly in SQL plus. So if you touch the TNS name that or means make sure that you are restarted the Oracle listener file. Okay. That's Oracle listener service. Sorry. So make sure that you have restart the Oracle listener service if you have touched the TNS name that or file. Okay, now come back. Uh, let me go to demo schema directory once again. Okay. Now, uh, sys at ORCL PDP as sysdba. So, I am logging to ORCL PDP pluggable database as a DBA. So, now I am going to start the installation of order entry schema. copy the path so as i have told here oe underscore main dot sql is the main entry point okay so we are going to execute that file oe underscore main dot sql okay so provide the password for oe user account oe is the password so table space will be users temp table space will be temp password for HR so it requires HR schema to be installed okay make sure that uh, you have already installed the HR schema okay so then provide this password then provide a path to the data files next provide the path to log files uh, specify the version next connect string so connect string I am giving as ORCL PDB local host colon 1521 slash ORCL PDB also valid one okay Yes.
Yeah, so order entry scheme and installation is done. So I am going to unlock the user or uh, OE. So alter user OE identity by OE account unlock so that you can log in anywhere. Okay. Now first I am going to try in uh, SQL developer. Okay. First I am going to try to log in as a OE user in SQL developer. Yes, I can able to log in. So the these are the database objects, tables, views, indexes. Functions types okay. sequences so you can learn many things from order entry schema and this order entry schema is a very good example schema for beginners contains many things okay so you can explore the order entry schema scripts if you have time okay so i can able to Browse a database object. Also, I can able to select some records. So let me try in uh, Oracle SQL Plus also. Okay, I am disconnecting from SQL Developer. Next, I am going to log in in SQL Plus as a OE user directly. Yes, I can able to log in as a OE user directly and also I can able to browse the database objects okay so finally uh, order entry sample schema installation in Oracle database 19c enterprise edition is successful make sure that you have replaced the sub underscore CWD string with absolute path and appropriate changes uh, whatever changes you needed in SQL files make sure that you have done it correctly so that will lead to the successful installation of order entry schema in Oracle database 19C.